Hey guys, Rob with Next Gen Writer here. So since I didn't have any success doing the over-the-air Wi-Fi beta upgrade of the Chiggy device, what I thought I'd do is I'll go ahead and do a tutorial or a video over uh, a manual update. So we'll get on the computer and I'm going to show you how to prepare your SD card and then we'll pop it in the Chiggy and see if we can do a manual update to the beta version, which should give us Fusion on the Chiggy AIO6 device. Let's get started. <clears throat> so to get to the right reference page, just go to Google and search Chiggy Manual Firmware Update. And then it's gonna take you into this page where you have some instructions, and then you'll also have a link to download the firmware package. So the firmwares are right here. There's the AI06 version 1.17, which I believe is the standard or the release version of the firmware. And there's 1.23, 1 uh, 1.2.3. So I'm gonna download the firmware. I'm gonna do it twice, okay. says it's zipping one file. Let's see what's going on in downloads. Okay, it started, but it's not done. There we go. Okay, so now in the downloads folder, I have the AI06 um, 1.2.3 firmware. So what we want to do is we want to prepare our SD card by formatting it um, in FAT32 format. So to get, I'm going to use Rufus because that's what they reference. I didn't see a FAT32 option through Windows. So if you go to rufus.ie, it'll take you to the site and it's just a straight executable. You don't have to install anything and I already have it downloaded right here, Rufus 4.9. So we'll launch Rufus, Let's choose yes. Choose the SD card. You wanna select non-bootable here. And then on file system, you wanna choose FAT32. And that should be all you have to do. Now we're gonna hit start. It's gonna warn you that all the data is gonna be destroyed. That's fine. And it's a pretty quick little process. Okay, so now we're done. So now here, it did put in some auto runs there, an icon and setup information. I don't think those are gonna hurt anything. I'll just leave them there. So now, now we'll go back to uh, downloads and we'll open up and there's a file here. Let me double check and see what Chiggy says. Uh, copy the firmware file, extract the zip file. Okay, don't change the file name. So what we'll want to do is copy this folder and take it and paste it into the SD card. While that's happening, I'm just gonna double check the instructions. So we're gonna power off, insert the SD card, and power on, and it should go into upgrade. All right, straightforward.
Okay, there we go. Now we got the SD card ready to go to insert into the Chiggy. So we'll do that next. Okay, so here we go. We got the camera back on the Chiggy. Have the SD card here. Cover's already off. We're gonna properly insert the SD card. Make sure it's captured. So let's turn it on and see what happens. Okay, Chiggy splash screen. Okay, detected the SD card, but it's telling me to format it. Hmm. Okay, we're not gonna do that. So, looks like there's a problem Maybe I need to take the files out of the folder. Uh, I just unzipped the folder, tried to follow the instructions. Let's give this another shot. Okay, so what I did is I put the uh, entire folder in the root of the SD card. And let's go over, extract the zip file to the root directory. And that is what I did, but it didn't like it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, so here are the upgrade files. So it's SR6 upgrade bin and then a text document. Okay. Looks like the text document is not a help file. It's a system file. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, copy these files and take them into root and I'm going to go ahead and delete these files okay so now what we have is we just have the raw two files in the SD card root and we're gonna give this a shot. Okay, attempt number two, SD card going into the Chiggy. See what happens. Ah, okay, there we go. Different results here. We've got an icon and a progress bar. So this looks promising. And now the Chiggy splash screen, and we're going into boot. Okay. And now it's booted and sees the SD card uh, is not properly formatted. So I don't want to format that card, so I'm going to power off. We'll remove the SD card. Actually, what I'll do so avoid errors I'll put the uh, the cam SD card back in okay now let's power on see what happens splash screen Okay, 
system came and we're up. So let's go into settings and check update. And there, I saw it already showed 1.2.3, but let's do the update check and see what it says. Okay, now it's going into an MCU upgrade. Okay. Rebooting. Okay. So now we're back up. Go in there one more time. 1.2.3. Let's just do the update check. Okay, now it's detected that the 4G module can be upgraded. So now we're going to select OK. Okay, says the upgrade module is successful. And now we have already up to date. There we go. So a few steps there. Uh, glad I did this video. Um, and hopefully it'll help you guys out. Uh, a very slow, uh, careful walkthrough of doing a manual firmware update on the Chigi AIO6. Thanks for watching.